Hi everyone, it's me Erin. Today I am going to show you how to make a sausage, egg, and hash brown casserole. The first thing you're going to want to do is whisk 10 eggs, a quarter of a teaspoon of black pepper, a half teaspoon of parsley, a half teaspoon of basil, and a half a tablespoon of minced garlic. Once you've whisked your eggs and your dry spices, you're going to add one pound of browned cooked pork sausage. I um, prefer to buy the pre-cooked sausage. Um, you're gonna add that to your egg mixture. Once you've added the sausage to your egg mixture, you're gonna go ahead and you're gonna add hash browns to it. I already use refrigerated hash browns that are thawed. If you prefer to buy frozen hash browns, that's fine. Just make sure that you thaw them out before adding them to your mixture. Next, I like to add some veggies to my sausage, egg, and hash brown casserole. So I add one cup of cut up onion, and I also like to add a cup of chopped up bell peppers. Our final ingredient is one cup of mild cheddar shredded cheese. Once you have all of the ingredients in there, you're just going to go ahead and mix it all up really well. Once you've mixed everything really well, you're then gonna go ahead and put it into a nine by 13 inch glass casserole dish. Make sure your casserole dish is greased so that it does not stick. All right, once you spread everything into the dish and it's all even, you're gonna go ahead and put it into the oven. And again, make sure your oven's preset to 400 degrees and you're going to set your timer for 25 minutes. Once you set the oven timer for 25 minutes, you're gonna go ahead and put the casserole into the oven. Please make sure you check it at 25 minutes. It might take up to 30 minutes to cook. You wanna make sure the egg in the center of the casserole is fully set. Once it's completely set, you can take it out of the oven, let it cool for a few minutes, then cut it up and serve. Enjoy.